So I'm walking back, walking back from the double quick, all nonchalant shit, you know what I'm saying? Blood all on me and shit, you know what I'm saying? I feel like a motherfucking man. I hear uh, uh, two truck ride by a white boy saying, fuck it, nigger, fuck it, nigger, hate you. They just keep on driving. I'm like, I hate you too, anyway. So on my way, I'm finna walk back to the house, you know what I'm saying? The double quick ain't, but. A, a whole block away from my high, right? So I'm walking back to the high, I'm blood and shit. I just did what I did. I see a little golden retriever, a little, a little puppy dog on the ground, man, uh, over there at the restaurant. It was, uh, it, it was, it was tips is then. Now everybody remember tips. Oh, I got some shit. I got some stories there, but they motherfuckers had two tips. Anyway, um, so uh, I picked up a little puppy dog, and I'm like, oh, baby, puppy, I like you, little cute dog. You my dog now. I kiss the dog until you my dog now. So I'm walking with a dog, walking in the house. Still blood in the motherfucker. Happy to be it, though. But I, <clears throat> by the time I get to the corner, right, the police then pulled up on me. So I hold my square, you know what I'm saying? Throw up my little signal, let them know who I am. Like, I'm a motherfucker age, you know what I'm saying? Some nigga just attacked me, and I fucked them up, you know what I'm saying? So they get out the car, and they were like, what's going on, bro? Just so happened that the leading officer that pulled up, the first one got the cops, decided to be one of my best friends. So I'm relieved to see this nigga. And I'm really ready to tell this nigga what just happened, you know what I'm saying? And so uh they say, uh, what's up? What's going on? I said, shit, I'm crazier than a motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and my nigga say, uh, he said, man, you ain't crazy. He said, where your gun at? I said, I ain't had no gun. He said, they, he said the people back at the store said you had a gun. I said, bro, I ain't had no motherfucking gun. Oh my God, I said, my gun in the house. I don't think I had my knife on me. You know what I'm saying? I done put the dog down. Dog took out. I'm mad. You know, my fucking dog. My little, little puppy dog that ran out. So uh, they're like, all right, go on how to clean yourself up. And this is when I find out that sea boss is actually good for blood, right? <laughs> anyway, I come in the house, man. I'm looking at myself in the mirror. I'm feeling proud, you know what I'm saying? I got to a few niggas up and survived another motherfucking Illuminati Freemason ass hit. I'm feeling good, you know what I'm saying? My, my little brother come by. It ain't my real brother, but it's a little nigga I, I took in. It, come to find out he was working with them, right? The whole time. See, they, I used to rent out rooms. I still rent out rooms in the back, right? They used to purposely have people come rent out rooms for me so they get close to me, to be in the same house with me so they can try to kill me, but it never worked. I was always... Niggas can't fuck with me, you know what I'm saying? I'm just keeping 100 with it. So, uh, yeah, so he come by, he see me in the mirror looking at myself. He looking at me, he just shaking it, he like, he said, boy, you losing it out here. I said, shit, I can't tell. Look how soft up I am. <laughs> Covered in blood, but I was clean them up. I said, look how soft up I am, though. And so I just so happened to have a, a, a tub full of water, right, that had sea moss in it. Actually, had sea moss, bird eye root, and bladder rack in it. Some told me to take the clothes off and put it in the tub. So I take my clothes off and let my clothes soak in the sea moss, bird eye root, and bladder rack. And man, about a matter of hours, bro, I pulled my shorts out first and all the fucking blood was gone. I'm like, damn, this is amazing. Sea moss gets rid of blood stains out of clothes. <laughs>